Hello, I am Sivendra Kumar Gupta. Today I am going to talk about real life use of your mechanics. In that I am going to talk about Cartesian Diver Experiment. Let's perform Cartesian Diver Experiment. This is called Cartesian Diver Experiment. To perform this, we should have a tank in a water bottle filled with water. I have used iron wire to increase the weight of this pen cap to a little bit balance this as you can see now it's its weight can be balanced so now I will put this in this water bottle and fill full water and now I will tie this such so that no water or air can escape from this so now it's tighter now we will see when we get pressure to this so this pen cap going down and when we release this it's going down when we keep pressure it's again going down and when we release it's going down now one question comes in our mind that why is it happening so i have shown in this in figure that uh, in starting the air quantities more in pen but now it's compressing because air is compressible material and water is not compressible water is incompressible so here air is getting compressed due to that volume is decreasing so reason first why it's sinking after compression is that due to compression butter goes more inside cap and air get compressed so the buoyancy force decreases because we know that what is buoyancy force buoyancy force the water di displaced by the body okay so here water displaced by the body is decreasing so the buoyancy force decreasing so that it's not able to balance it so due to less buoyancy food it's going to sink let's talk about another reason what is like as we know that any body which has less density than water the body will float in water otherwise if density of body is more than water then body will sink in water so initially the density of water is less than water as we have added the iron wire weight such that it does not sink in water as we know density equals to mass upon volume and mass of the body equals to mass of plastic pen cap plus mass of air plus mass of iron wire which is constant in both situations because mass is not changing so now density equals to constant upon volume so we can say that density is inversely proportional to volume and now volume of water is equal to volume of plastic pen cap plus volume of iron wire plus volume of air and now we can see in the figure that volume of air is decreasing it means volume of water is decreasing and we know that if volume is decreasing so density will increase because density is inversely proportional to volume so new density is going to be more than density of water that is why body is sinking in the water bottle after applying pressure thank you